Oh god, are we in desert land now? The sun is shining very brightly in my eyes here. Well, oh my god, will you just go away? Why are the stupid yell grunts everywhere? Because they really like Marty. But Marty's nowhere to be found! Go, they're, go! They're sabotaging you for Marty! And they're failing catastrophically! I love- I, I love- <laughs> I love TVO. I hate them- I hate them with a fiery passion. Marnie, I just- I don't really have anything- I don't have any positive reactions or negative reactions to Marnie. But I hate Team Yell so much. I love much. Marnie. Marnie's great. I can tell. Best. You, you've told me. Yes, I have. Who are you? Hello there. I promise not to wake the Pokemon. Will you let me through? Of course, it'll be our pleasure! What? What? She just gets to walk on through? And let me get well, to She's not a gym challenger! So, what if I throw on a wig and say, I'm just an old man. Back in my day, we didn't have to fight no Pokemon to get through Route 6. Will they let me through? You probably try. Don't suppose you'll let us through. We're way too loud for you? What? What? Oh my god, I hate these people so much. They're the worst. They're actually the worst. Okay, well, I guess we gotta fight them. Let's go, let's do it. You two are way too noisy, you don't wanna wake up Silly Cobra now, do you? I see you, you are st stomping on the ground like a petulant child. Oh my god. Alright, well, I guess it's time to fight freaking Team Yell again. Team Yell's like the Warden Eternal from Halo 5. He just never- they just- they never stop showing up. Like a plague on the game. The sunlight that is, is harsh. What a, uh, that is what a Pokemon villain team does. They continually show up, even when they're not wanted. And it does appear that we're in a- we're in a desert land now. We're, we're on Tatooine, apparently. Uh, which, on that note, out of, out of curiosity, do you watch The Mandalorian? Yes. I watched the first episode. I haven't gotten around to the second episode yet, so don't say anything. Oh, I have. I, I you you should know full well that I am n by no means a Star Wars fan. So I, you do not have to worry about me spoiling anything. I I know absolutely nothing about Star Wars. Good. I was I was just I I, mean, I, I the only question I would have asked is uh, is it worth it for someone who has no idea what? Yes. I, oh, I, I, I do have two. That was amazing. Paralyze. Well, I guess I. Hmm. All right. Uh, I guess we're gonna switch out of you. Okay. Let's get a. Uh... Oh, but oh, also I caught a I caught a panda and I called and I named him Poe. And then named him Poe. And... <laughs> what? Because Kung Fu Panda. Come on. Because Kung Fu Panda. But... Oh my god. Also, I caught a little fire type snake thing and I called him Mushu. <laughs> It's a fire type Pokemon that looks like a little lizard, but has the fire breathing abilities of a, of a dragon. I feel like you're someone who do somewhat well in a Nuzlocke and then cry at the uh, cry every time their Pokemon died. I'm someone who does what with a what now? Oh, you don't know what a Nuzlocke is. How how is this a surprise to you at this point? Uh, well. Good question. Uh. By default, you should assume I know nothing about Pokemon. It's true. Uh, well, there's. Nuzlocks are basically like death runs. Ah, I see. Sounds sounds like a blast. It's basically you treat it as like if your Pokemon faints, they quote unquote die, and you can't use them for the rest of the run. Ah. Yeah, that, that's, I've heard some people play play like that. By by choice, uh, just to just to keep things more challenging. Yep. Cause like with the amount of revives I have, I could just like infinitely revive people, and never have to worry about it. But yeah, in regards to Mandalorian, I've I've heard I've heard great things about it. I just don't care at all about Star Wars, so it just has not intrigued me to the point where I wanted to, where I actively wanted to give it a shot. Uh, but. Yeah, no, just, you don't have to worry about spoiling anything from me. 
because I or you don't have to worry about me spoiling anything for you. I should say. Yay. Not a threat, because trust me, I I know how. And, and like even even if I did, even if I had watched the show, I there's no chance now I would have ever spoiled anything for you. There's nothing I hate more than getting. Th Spoil. Than, yeah, like. I'm not the I, I the thing I am still salty about five years later is Halo Five came out. I I picked it up from the store. I drove home. I, I put it in the console and I st it started downloading, and then my friend texted me saying, "Hey, did you get to the part where da 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 da, -da happens?" And the, uh... the and the da 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 that happened was something that got revealed in the second to last mission of the game and is like the big twist and it's like, thanks, pal. You, you sure are a bright one, you. And it's like, we, I. Uh, Hmm. I'm not salty, and it's it's like by the way, I don't. Salty, he said. his teeth together. I had been waiting for this game for three goddamn years. I'm not salty. <laughs> I can hear you grinding your teeth and saying. Well, like I just don't understand the mindset behind it. It's like, cause we we went to the like we both got home at the same time. Why would he have assumed? that I would have somehow managed to get through six hours of gameplay in half an hour. How, how did you, how do you, like, I, I, I'm left to assume it was done maliciously, because no one's that stupid. I'm left Unless to assume- they are. He's not, he, he is, he, he's, he has a very good head on his shoulders. I, I, I know for, well, like, if he, if he was going to do it, he would have done it maliciously. But the thing is, like, he, I, I know when he's pissed off. He wasn't pissed off that day. He would have, he, 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 well, at least not, in front of me or at me, it, it might have just been, like, a, a byproduct or an aftermath, like projecting his anger towards me, even though I didn't do anything to, to actually, you know, antagonize him. But it so just sucks. Are you sucks. sure you're not salty? <laughs> I'm absolutely positive that I have absolutely no salt at all about this. Okay. <laughs> None whatsoever. Um, now, so uh, on the other, on the other side of that, I would I'll also say that like. If you're online, like any kind of social, social, I combine public and social, social media platform publicly, and you are actively checking comments or something, uh, and then you get spoiled, I, I have no, I don't, I don't want to say I have no sympathy, but at that point it's like, you kind of did this to yourself if you're online checking these kinds of things, um, but it, it, like if, if 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 someone privately messages you, hey, um this this thing happens and it's out of your control then at that point it's like that's not your that's not your fault at all that's just someone being a tool to you for absolutely no reason but yeah just 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 don't it's not nice to spoil things to people because like people actually care about this kind of stuff and to just to to to, to destroy someone else's experience for that is like I, I mean the only time the only time that i actually have spoiled something for someone is because I was playing an online game with my friend uh, shortly after Avengers Endgame came out, and he was being an absolute tool to us. Like he was just being the most toxic, honestly, probably the most toxic person I've ever played with any in any game ever. With uh, he was just, he was just constantly dragging us down the whole time, like yelling at us, insulting us in every de every degree possible. Just re a really toxic person to be playing a game with. Um, so at that point. I'm like, all right, I've had enough of this. Have you watched Avengers Endgame yet? And he said no, and that was where he went wrong. Because then I had a, oh, a plethora of things to dispel upon to him. Since he was so eager to, to, to use his voice chat to communicate with us. Like, like I, I maybe, maybe you deserve a little bit of spoilers. But, like, if you're just... If it's just a thing where it's like, you know... We're, we're, we're mutual friends, and you're excited about something, and I like there's there's no motive, there's no motivation for me to spoil anything for anybody, or for you to spoil anything for any, anyone else, unless you're being rude to me, or just being toxic to people in general. Because then I'm like, okay, maybe it's time to do this. That was a really long-winded explanation, but yeah, that's the only time. That's the only time I've ever spoiled. Why do I keep learning so many new moves? There's, uh, you keep leveling up. That's why. No, like one at like this is all in one giant, uh continuous thing right here. I haven't even... I just defeated one Pokemon, and now it's just move up to move up to move up to move. That, she hasn't even sent it on anyone Pokemon else yet. It? It's all of them. Every single one of them. Okay, at least... Well, I defeated, where are you at? I'm in, I'm in the, the mid-20s. 
Uh, that's probably why. Okay, because I finally... Think, at some point, you're gonna ha hit a cap where you, your Pokémon don't learn new moves every time they level up. Like, I definitely hit that cap. So, like, you're gonna hit a bit where, like, every other level they're going to learn something new. Oh, Hop's having a moment of intros introspection. I just can't get those words out of my head. If I'm weak, oh, then people God. think Lee's weak too. But I don't want that. I can't let Lee get dragged down. He's the unbeatable champion. I'm gonna have to take some time figuring this out. See you around, Trevor. Okay, bye. Bye. Bye, Hop. See you later. I'm not gonna- Don't let the door hit you on the way out. I'm not gonna miss you. Oh, we woke up the- We woke up the snake thing. Oh, no. Okay, bye. It's, it's, nice. No, I hope you enjoyed your nap. Oh, mystery person. You're one of the gym challenges endorsed by Leon, aren't you? Oh, that, that was the wrong voice. Oh, dear God. That was the wrong voice for this person on my screen. My name's Opal. If you want to know more, have a look at my lead card. You got... Oh. Oh. You, you, you good over there? Yep. Okay. You, you, you made a Opal. noise. I yep, I met... Oh. It's, it's Opal. I, I'm getting a lot of lead cards. I'll, I'll keep an eye on you, the Chad. end of this, by the way. I'm watching you, Wazowski. Always watching. This is my voice for Roz. <sighs> anyway, let's continue our journey along Route 6 and see where this takes us. Oh. My stupid cute Pokemon is interested in your Pokemon. Okay, well, do you want to send him on a date? Because we can do that if you want. But like, I don't. I don't think you need to. F I don't think you need to fight my Pokemon. If you, if, if if they're interested in me, that's fine. Or if they're interested in my Pokemon, that's fine. But like, we'll send them on a date to go somewhere. We don't. We don't gotta fight this out. I mean, okay, whatever. Bubble's still poisoned. I don't. I don't. I don't think I have poison heal. So is he, I guess he's just permanently poisoned, right? I don't antidote. Have any... It's called an antidote. Oh, okay. I have this. There we go. Use use the item. I'll use it on Bubble. Okay. There we go. I've been cured of my poison. <laughs> Well, uh, hold on a minute. I have I have things called burn heal, so it's logical to assume that there, if I have it, it would be called poison heal. In fact, let me check. Let me let me check my bag again just to make sure. Yeah, I have ice heal, burn heal, and paralyze heal. So yeah, logical. you're not entirely wrong. <laughs> anyway, okay. Well. Now, let's use Water Pulse against this pink fluffy cloud. That did not do a whole lot, I must admit. Oh, you're using Metronome. Stop wagging your finger at me! Posing... Use, oh, using Acid. Okay, well, that's that, that didn't do much either. But my, my special defense fell, I guess. Okay. Um, yeah, so I don't know... Because, like, I, I've, been, I've gotten a lot of suggestions from people in the comments. If I was to continue playing Pokemon games after this point... Um, I, I, I wouldn't know where to be because I've had, I've had a lot of different, different suggestions. And then... Uh, I, I've, I've gotten that, certainly. I've also gotten the, uh, the Pokemon Mystery Dungeons, uh, series. Oh, I need to make a pitch for an underrated Pokemon game series. Do you know what Pokemon Rangers is? I, no, I, I don't. It is amazing. It is so, it's, I so wish they would make a new one. There are three games in the series. It's it's so good. I can't explain how good this game is. Platform. Uh, uh no, it's a it's a 3DS game. So, so well, no, it's not a 3DS game. It's just a normal DS game. It was this this came out when I was like when I was like little little when I was first getting into Pokemon. I love these games because they were so much fun. I yeah. highly recommend you play it. <laughs> that, that's the thing. It's just like there's so many different uh, types of... There's, there's so many different games to, to start to, to continue after this point. There's a question of do I want to spend the money on the DLC? Do I want to do a different game? Do I want to continue the games at all? It, 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 it's an ordeal. but. Oh, we'll get to the end of this game and find out. I mean, what I, what I could do is I could just, I could just make a poll. Like I I'll, like collect the top the top recommended games and say okay out of these what do you want me to see or what do you want to see next and then majority rules at that point see what people say based on that Poe isn't I 
Did I read that correct? Did that say Poe is immobilized by love? Yes. What? What? Oh, 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 okay. That's, that's bait 101. Make, make my Pokemon fall in love with your Pokemon and then beat the crap out of him. Great. This is lovely, okay. So, I, I, I this isn't gonna do anything. Poe is in love. Oh, but I still use low sweep. I mean, it's getting your health, that's not, yeah, it's not very effective because you're in love with the person you're fighting. Not generally a great idea. This panda, uh, I swear. <laughs> yes? Uh, you found the charm effect. This is hilarious. I, I'm, my panda can't do anything because it's in love with the thing it's fighting. This is... You're going to need to switch it out. <laughs> no, I just defeated it. It's, it's fine. You Unless... sure? I mean... You should be fine, but just check it. Well, I mean, apparently, apparently the, he, the, Anita or whatever her name is, yeah, Beauty Anita has another one up her sleeve. Oh my god, it's the, we got a Clefable this time. Alright, Zap, I, I've been leveling up Zap a lot, let's see if, uh, let, let's see if Zap can prove his worth. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, the, the thing is, there these are all like level 30 Pokemon and I'm level like mid 20 24 so this isn't going too well but i mean i'm 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 persevering we're doing fine oh we just got a lot bigger hold on all right maybe not maybe i've overstayed my welcome a little bit well i mean at least i paralyzed you and since i paralyzed you uh now what we're going to do is we're going to get mushu back into the fight cuz i need i need fire type uh let's Pokemon are now named after Kung Fu Panda characters. One? It, no, wait, Mushu's the dragon. Uh, yeah, Mushu's from Mulan. Mushu's from, Mushu's from Mulan. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I... I I'm admit, not dead, I swear. I don't... I, I didn't... I never said that. I don't think I've ever said anything implying that to you even a little bit. You're incredibly oh, competent. But the, way, the ways, I, the things I do sometimes, highly suggest it. Well, I got my phone stuck in a piano yesterday. You, you got your what stuck in a what? I got my phone stuck in a piano. <laughs> How did you manage that one? <laughs> no, 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 no. I want to know now. You, you, you presented that. That you presented a scenario that sounds incredibly comical, and now, now I wish to know how you got to that point. So, are we, are we, are we gonna are we, are we gonna get story time? So. People like story time. Story time. I, I had I was at. Story time. I was at the art center for my college because I needed to practice for uh for our for the singing program. And, you know, I was using the piano to, like, figure out what notes I needed to sing, because I also am trying to learn the piano a bit, so that's how I was multitasking with the thing I was supposed to be doing and the thing I wanted to be doing. Um, but, <laughs> I was, I, I, gone, I gone through the first song, and I was working on the second one, and I'm like, as I'm practicing the second one, I'm like, I'm working on, I'm closing the piano lid. And at that same moment as I'm closing the lid, my phone falls off of the, um, the music stand. Where I had the music up and my phone up right next to it on the piano. And the, my phone fell off the stand and it fell into the, this tiny crack that was open between the cover of the piano and the interior of the piano as it was closing. And it fell straight in. And I couldn't get it out. So they had to come in and take off, like, the cover of the piano so they could pull it out. <laughs> and so that was my Saturday afternoon. Though, so the first part of my Saturday afternoon, I was downtown. Because they were- everyone was celebrating the election. Yeah, makes sense. Yeah, I have a- bunch of videos of basically people honking their horns. Like, it was 
insane. Because, like, just for context sake, I'm in Chicago. Like, in downtown Chicago, like, not far after, like, when you go take a bike ride. Not, like, far from where, like, the Lakeshore, Lakeshore Drive ends. There's Trump Towers right there. And everyone was gathering in front of it, and we could hear it from the park. Yeah, uh... I would ask if you were okay with with that location information, but then I realized that you, I, I obviously know, so you wouldn't you wouldn't say that unless you you were fine with people knowing that. The big city. Yeah. There's kind of a couple million people here. Just 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 a couple. <laughs> just just a couple. Just just a, a small amount of people in Chicago. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, I imagine that was fairly hectic, but. Yeah, everyone everyone has their moments. Everyone has their their dull moments or the the, the moments where they 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 make some they make some silly mistakes. But trust me, I've 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 never never for a second have I have I questioned your intelligence on anything at any point. Now by competency. <laughs> right. So there was also the time when you were driving out of my neighborhood and you you decided the best way to get out was by going past the was by driving where the dead end sign I was. I drove like three circles around your neighborhood trying to figure out how to get out of your neighborhood and one of those times you you drove where the dead end sign was i my brain switches off sometimes sometimes and, like, yeah. sometimes we mean like 50 percent of the time it's a toss-up we uh, get there eventually in the end it takes a while no one trusts me to drive I, like at all can you blame them no I really can't. It's my like, own let's, fault. Let's be perfectly clear here. I think that's all brought on by yourself. Uh, yeah. Anyways, back to the Pokemon game and not my incompetency with many facets of life. Well, let's be clear here. That that one was that, that one was brought on by you. You you opened the gateway and then I then I introduced the dead end thing and then from there the the snowball kept rolling. So yes, it just it just kept getting worse. <laughs> but in the context of Pokemon, I I, de I defeated beautiful Anita or, or whatever her name is. Uh, What's and her my... face? Person who was trying to beat you. And my my Pokemon were so drained after that battle that I had to go all the way back to town to heal them up. Never had to do that before. You can go you... camping. You want Make me to go camping? All right, I'll, I'll go camping after I defeat this ya mask. But used water pulse, and that drain well, himself. You know what? Yeah. You want your mask? Uh, I, I, ha I have a mask, yeah. You want to go get it? I'll, I'll put on a mask, sure. Oh my god. <laughs> Wear a mask. Your mask. Yeah, yeah, I got one. Try over there. Okay. Th this is annoying to you, isn't it? I'm... <laughs> you can just hear, like, the silence. I, I, I can hear your brain, like, struggling. It's like, no, why is he, why is he doing this to me? It's like it's like fighting the urge to just scream my head off, because you you hear the person like no what are, no what are you doing? Anyway, uh, you you were saying something yes. Well, what is it about what is it about your mask? Do you do you want one? Uh, well, I mean, not anymore. I I I've lost that opportunity. Kind of I, I kind of took it out. Uh -huh. But yeah, I'm I'm pretty happy with my team. I gotta be, I gotta be honest. Uh. Although I might try to catch this thing. This thing looks like it wants to be my friend. What is it? A wild maractus, mar mar not a cactus, a maractus. I'm I am assuming that this is a grass type, for obvious reasons. So with that in mind, let's go ahead and get uh, let's get Mushu out here. The only the only time I, I plan on I mean unless I encounter something. Uh, else looks kind of cool. I'm planning on getting a sheep at some point, naming it Sonic the Hedgehog, and then calling it a day for my for my team. That's about, about my. <laughs> well, yeah, because the sheep roll around at the speed of sound. That's all they do. All right, flame wheeling. Almost entirely took him out. I'm gonna I'm gonna be gonna be cautious here. Oh, by the way, uh, I got screwed over hardcore. Because in the in the gym challenge, the, the fire gym challenge, I'm like, alright, this is cool, you know, just uh, fight some trainers and then you go do the thing. I got screwed over because there's a thing we, ha we have to 
you have to add points. Uh, oh, how was that? I I, <laughs> I didn't actually watch that, so I have no idea what happened. Oh, I'll tell you what happened, all right. So. I, I have a feeling I know what happened since I played the Dad Gym Challenge already. I caught the first- I want to hear from you. <laughs> I caught the Pokemon very easily. Then I went on to the next one. And I was able, like, I, I got it. I, I knew that because because my other, my, I knew because my, my, my opponent or my teammate was going to be doing damage. I had to, I had, I had to back off to let him do damage so that I, I, when my turn came around, I would be able to catch it because its health would be low. I got, I waited until its health got down to like one pixel. One pixel was left on the screen of its health bar. And I'm like, all right, here we go. Throw out the Pokeball. Easy win. Let's get this W. And let me tell you something. There's nothing more frustrating than throwing a Pokeball when it has one pixel of health left and the game just going, nah, you don't get to catch this Pokemon today. Back to the drawing board with you. And then, because my teammate is an idiot, he's just like, oh, let's, let's just, de let's defeat it. Let's not try oh, to your, catch your it. Your teammate's not an idiot. He was sabotaging you. <laughs> well, I thought we were supposed to be working together. No, you weren't. They were, for they were there to make sure you weren't winning. What? <laughs> Well, I... <laughs> they, they, they actively... I don't... I guess you didn't see it when they actively attacked you. I... I, I guess I didn't. Yeah, I, no, you, when you were in the double battle, their goal was entirely to not let you get points. Well, they did it. It worked very well. Um, I, I emerged victorious. I mean, I, I would still... Let's, let's, keep, let's make this very clear. I would still... Much rather do that than sheep wrangling any day of the week. Well, at least it's only going up from here. I, I don't think anything could possibly be worse than that sheep wrangling. Apparently, some people actually really Wait. like the sheep wrangling. Yes. And I have no idea why. Um, I, I'm thinking about it now. Oh, no. You may. Oh, no. No. You may get infuriated. No. No, I don't want to. No. What could be worse? What could be worse than that? You'll find out, and at this moment, I really wish I could see your screen. I'm just, I'm just climbing the ladders. But, uh... But what about my screen did you want to see? Uh... <laughs> you'll find... You'll, you'll understand when you get there. Sneak behind him. Sneak behind her. I think I successfully avoided a Pokemon trainer. I, I undoubtedly did it. I can't sneak past you, though. Yeah, there's. I, I I saw someone. She was she was holding. She was wearing like purple clothes. She was holding a pokeball in her hand. Like she was actively trying to find people to fight. And I'm like, okay, let's see if we can sneak around you. And then I did. So, but then there's another one right here. Pokemon is R two. We both give it our all. Okay. Let's fight. Uh, Artist Duncan. See, this 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 name is appropriate because we're gonna obviously dunk on him. Uh huh. Get it? Cause. Duncan? Yeah? No? Oh, okay. Crickets. Lots I, of crickets. <laughs> I, I expected- I, I expected reimbursement from my- from my top- top tier comedy, but unfortunately, I did not get the- no. <sighs> oh well. Okay. So now, now we're facing off against a coughing. So. Coughing! I don't know what type this is, but I'm just gonna use bubble. Poison. Alright, well, I don't have I don't have a psychic Pokemon and I don't think I have any ground attacks. And since Bubble just drained half his health immediately. He'll be fine. I'm pretty sure he's also a rock type. Like that that's the thing, is that freaking um I, I, if I don't have the, the type I need for a certain for a certain Pokemon, unless they take half damage from from water type. Bubble is so strong and so powerful that he can just destroy anything in his path, no matter what. So I can always, I can always rely on Bubble to save the day if I need him to. Oh. Oh. Yes. Yes. What? No, I just hit a cut seed. Don't worry. <laughs> I see. All right, like gain some, I gain some more experience points. I got- I, I'm liking my team. I haven't used Howler all that much. Uh, oh, we have a- Poe has learned a new move. Okay, we got Work Up. Uh, the user's rouse and its attack and special attack stats increase. That seems... 
that's the thing. I, I haven't really used the stat buffs or, or debuffs attacks. I've just been really mainly using the standard attacks. But I'm sure at some point I'll have to do that. But for the time being, we're still doing all right. And yeah, everyone's... My highest level... Bubble's level 32. With Krabbit not far behind, 29. Howler, Howler's 29, Mushi's 27, Zap's 25, and Poe, because he's the newest to the team, is level 20. So. Yeah. You know, I, yeah. Managed, I managed to go my entire run without a rock or a, um, a rock or ground type Pokemon. I probably should have caught one at some point. I just never wanted to. I mean, I'm not really... That's kind of the same here. I'm not. I'm not super eager now that I have a team that I know works really well. I'm not really. I don't really have the desire to uh, to, to to catch new types because I I haven't encountered anything that has that's like halted my progress. I mean, I just I just encountered a, a tree thing, pseudo wudo. Uh, pseudo wudo is a not. <laughs> what type do you think pseudo wudo is? My 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 gut instinct as to what type pseudo. Pseudo, 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 pseudo. I'd say he's pseudo probably. A, well, I, my my gut instinct would be he was rock type, and the and based on the fact that he just used a rock attack on me to immediately kill me, seems to support that theory. Yeah, and when I was when I did it, the I always forget he's a rock type. <laughs> like I know he's a rock type. But I always, like, my first instinct is grass, because I see tree and I go grass, but then I'm like, no, it's rock. Don't do what you're about to do. That's stupid. And then I do it anyways. Well, I mean, according to, uh, this chart thing... No, he's a rock type. No, no, I, I was actually, I, I was gonna see if, I, if there were any... I was hoping there would be at least one common thing that it takes double damage from, so I could be like, well, at least it, it, there's one thing you could use that does dam double damage to both, and then I checked and I'm like, nope, there isn't, unfortunately. No, they're, 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 they're literally nothing alike, and I have a bad habit of like, I see Sudo and I'm like, oh, I could use my fire type, and then my fire type, which is weak to the rock type, immediately gets stuffed out. And just to, I should have seen that coming. And just to be clear here, uh, if I ever do catch a pseudo wudu, I am naming it Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. I am Groot. Teenage. I am Teenage. Groot. Don't curse at me, Groot. Teenage oh. angst, Groot. Well, what was your favorite incarnation of Groot? Uh, I, I, have, I have asked her the I impossible really question. Watching. I have asked her the impossible question. We will be here for centuries before she answers I it. I like all of them. <laughs> Baby Groot's adorable. Teenage Groot is really funny and relatable, honestly. <laughs> oh, Big Groot is just sad. and I. We are Groot. <laughs> yeah, I have two whole new words to his vocabulary. Uh... Since since it's only fair for me to answer the same question I proposed, I would I would probably I probably pick uh, Baby Groot as well just because of how cute he is. Um, I, I I pick none. I love them all too much. You abstain from you abstain from voting. Yes. Let's buy some more revives. Time to go to Stow on side. Hey, that's where I am. I think. I, I, I would logically assume that's where I am because this is the town. Like, if I read the sign, does it say... Yep, okay, I have I have arrived at the town of Stow on Side. A vibrant town that has grown up around an ancient mural tucked away in the mountains. Well, here we are. 